practice day for the New Horizons band. To me, music is, is it, it's, it's everything. It's a music education group whose motto is, it's never too late. I encourage as adults who either played music in their youth or in high school and dropped it and they want to get back into it after a 30 or 40 year absence to come and learn how to play a, a band instrument. Or if you've ever wanted to learn how to play an instrument as an adult, you don't have a lot of options but we are the answer for you because we encourage people. You don't have to have any experience. And for participants, it's not even only about music. It's not only gonna be physically engaging, it's mentally engaging, it's socially engaging, it's spiritually engaging. There's no downside to learning how to play music. And they were able to maintain the music learning over the past two years by going digital. Um, they had enrichment classes, uh, music interest classes. Um, we continued to play through Zoom calls. It was really incredible what they did. And you were able to keep playing music. Exactly. The group offers three levels in both concert and jazz bands. And in the fall, we'll start a new loner program that they hope will encourage even more adults to pick up an instrument for the first time. They don't even know what the instrument, how it fits together, all the bits and pieces. They don't know any of that stuff. So we made it really easy, thanks to a, a grant from the federal government. We purchased enough instruments to fit out two beginner bands. So now you can join and we will give you an instrument for the first term. And they're hoping that will grow their music circle of inclusion even bigger. I discovered this band and instantly I came and I play my little part and it's part of this whole thing and I just loved it. Well, they're hoping to start the Loner program this September. If you're interested in becoming a member, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras for information. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.